Malfurion contra Anduin. <laughs> it's just a sacerdote. It's a sacerdote. That's silly. Who do you think you are, sacerdote? Un placer saludarte. Hola. Puedo cruzada, pero no uh, tengo un dos. Listo. Empiezo un cruzada al dragón. Here it goes. Hmm. So, uh, La Luvia? Si, sí, La Luvia. Esa cruzada. Esa cruzada. Um, Es buena para, uh, es mala against los Morlocos. Uh, Solari asks, any word if your TV interview will be available online? I don't know yet. Take some time for them to make the stuff. I'll ask about it soon. Unete. Or morirá. Todo se inclina ante mí. Okay, uh, un four six, pretty scary. Cuatro uh, seis. Unete o morirás. A lot of people um, make fun of priests for getting those Herrera Maliosiosis, but uh, Pero, cinco mana por un cuatro seis es, es así así. Uh, Lax Ross asks, are you doing a poll to name the bear? Uh, yeah, that's the intention. I'll probably take some open suggestions first, and then of the ones that seem to be garnering some popularity, I'll take a poll from those. Escudos listos. Hmm, four, two, and then I guess I have to use this one. Don't absolutely need to. O morirás. Maestro returning either of these looks better. But returning the cruzada is actually not bad. Kind of annoying for a priest to deal with it. I don't even remember a silly name for a priest, I'm just gonna say Priesto. Ah, Sacerdotis. It's like, why are we even calling them Sacerdotis? Just call them Priestos or something. Right, right? Am I right? Okay, three. Use the Flagolo and the Guardian. Uh, buen buen. Bueno bueno. Either way. Value. Okay, kind of annoying, but not too bad. Dame una visión. Value. 
Oh man, got some value. Thank you to Sly Wolf. Says, I was wondering when you would do another match like the beard match you did against Total Biscuit. Love you and keep doing what you do. He's a busy guy, um, but yeah, I'd love to set something like that with him up again sometime. And Harahuna says, Hello Trump, I'm from Barcelona and native Spanish speaker. I've been watching you night in, night out since last summer. I'm having a lot of fun listening to you tonight. Keep up the good work. Uh, ah, great. A native uh, speaker. Heard it here first. Uh, native Barcelona speaker approves of Trump's Spanish. I, am, I must admit, I am pretty skilled. Spanish uh, was one of my worst grades in high school, on a side note. As poor K, no, uh, no quiero travelar. Buena jugada. Four, six, uh, Me has Buena jugada. Mm, buena jugada. So Burn asked, do you watch anime? If so, what's your favorite one? Well, my favorite one is listed on the info sheet. I think it's code Yes. I believe that's what I listed. And just for you, I'm gonna get out my anime list. A list of uh, animes that I've watched. It's <laughs> hora de un poco de sangre. Por la cruzada. ¿Qué debería hacer? ¿Qué debería hacer? Yuvo Rex asked, do you like the Elder Scrolls? Yeah, I liked playing the um, game. That's pretty good. Oh, She got even more adorable in Espanol. I almost feel bad. Almost. Oh man, we got some Leroy Valley there. Got a few possibilities here. One is to use hmm. the Ogre Puno, but uh, it's kind of scary against Polymorph. But it does escape Fireball. Uh, it's a trade he wants to make, but that card is so good that I kind of have to. Could also just Luvia and uh, trade. That might be better. Uh, mucho gusto al Frederic Cavist uh, por quince dólares? Quince? <laughs> Makes sense. Close enough. Gracias. Oh, apparently, it's cincuenta. Pásame la llave de tu arcar con luz. Debemos purificar la fuente de sangre. Yo aplastar. <sighs> All right. Well, the guardian, of course, is going to do two damage. And then I have four mana. Probably use the acidic stamp swamp ooze. Actually, I have four, but it's not going to be in effect. Yo aplastar. A little bit scared of getting flamestruck. Uh, of course you would. Everyone's got to be a little bit scared. Um, in the case of flamestruck, I think I'll be okay enough. Blizzardio? Ah, Commando Pico Tormenta. Oh, a flag of those is good. 
flag waves tend to be pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Here's the uh, Guardian to finish off the 1 2, your ability to have the Trey Uno value. And get my Paco Lisco. And I agree, that was pretty value. Thank you to Ethiopia for your donation. It says, love your haircut, greetings from Denmark. Oh man, it's been a while, but like my style? Thanks. Have I watched No Game No Life? Let me look up what that is. No, I haven't. That sounds kind of like looking at the uh, description. Kind of sounds like something that seems interesting. Let's see, three. If I manage to save the coin for the next, you know, it's too um, ambitious. But I could do three uh, zero eleven. It's too ambitious. Drakkar Iyer plus Druida de la Zarpa, I think. Or maybe the Caballero. Now the Druida is better because it um, survives the flame strike. Possible flame strike. Uh, Prop Hat says, "Have you watched Trigun Helsing, FLCL, Cowboy Bebop? They're classics." I've never been one to really pay much attention to classics. Uh, Evangeline also. Hmm. I have no. Re it's not that I have no respect for the classics, and I appreciate that they're classics because they're good. But to me, scumbag Trump, I'm like, ah, they're old. They're old stuff. Why would I want to watch old stuff? And that's my reasoning for not having watched them. All right, so yeah, uh, shot that makes sense. Three, five, ten. Very vulnerable against flame strike. I guess I can trade for safety's sake. Yeah, the risk of getting flame struck is too high. It's not worth dealing an extra four damage for the possible risk of getting destroyed. By the way, um, so the rapid fire question bonus has been reached. Uh, let me let's get the question thing online. So what is going to happen? Some of you may have been around earlier. I'll have the question spreadsheet up, and then we'll just uh, gather a bunch of them, and I'll answer like twenty of the best ones. Uh, rapid fire was. Doomer asks, what were your favorite video games when you were a little Trump? Oregon Trail? I liked, um, I actually still have, let me, let me grab it, and it brings back memories. La verdad es mi escudo. Debemos purificar el fondo de la That's kind of scary. Do I want to use my hero ability to get rid of it? If I use this, I can uh, double buff the adventure. But if I use the hero ability, I can kill the 3 2. Uh, neither of them survive flame strike, so I might as well play this one. <laughs> might look like the five damage survives by the hero bone. All right, so we got the Oregon Trail two. I played the heck out of this one. Oh man, I wonder if this still works. Oh, it's still in here. Sweet. Eight, thirteen, nineteen. Uh, educational benefits. This game, though, Capitalism Plus. This is like the pinnacle of games that I like, and I'm a little sad that nothing like it has come 
Um, I credit this to why I'm generally good at economic build-up games. Wow, copyright 1997. This might have uh, affected my childhood to, in a direction of wanting to be a CEO or something. It's a game where you, like, you basically build buildings and uh, you build factories and department stores and you manufacture stuff from your farms and mines into your factories and you uh, ship them over to your retail centers and so on. It's pretty cool. Alright, Golem is really bad right now. I think I, I stimulate out the Draco. Yeah, it's basically like theme park and the tycoon games. Okay, um, hero ability plus 2-4, that's fine. Uh, what do I think of Hajime no Ippo? I thought it was a good, um, anime. I'm not really one who enjoys violent animes too much. But that one was okay, it was more about a story of personal growth and difficulty. The questy type stories. I can dig this. Lightbladed asks, what happens when you play Nixia while having a Sword of Justice equipped? Uh, I think you're Nixia and four of your whelps get buffed. I think the Nixia gets buffed first, but I'm not 100% sure. Bestoge asks if you were to have 2v2 in real life fight, which card would you choose to have your back and why? Uh, Tyrion Fordring, he's got, he's pretty buff, he's got the Divine Shield, and uh, he's got Taunt. I don't wanna get my thing, I don't wanna value. Slightly fun fact, I've never been actually in a fight, like a, well yes, pretty much. Because I'm a peace lover. Power Bot asks, what was your childhood like? I liked playing computer games. I didn't study too hard, but was naturally uh, talented at gaming the system of homework, mm. so I managed to get away with playing a lot of computer games. It's probably shaped me to what I am now. Sunshine asked, did you know RuneScape? I know of it, I don't play it, I know it's still going on. I actually briefly considered playing it. Briefly. I'm gonna put the 6-3 in the middle, since anything with Betrayal kills the other two, so I might as well put the biggest thing in the middle. Kind of a rare... Uh, thing to do. Doomer asks, how about your favorite movies from that time period? I never was a big movie person. I probably enjoyed watching some Disney movies, Groundhog Day, and stuff. JJ Max asks, have I ever been recognized out in the world? Yes, I have. It's fun to... It's fun when that happens. Kind of fun. Mostly fun. No, 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 I'll just hero ability. Why well, use a swipe? Yeah, because I have two swipes. Better watch out. If I'm using swipe on you, it means I feel very confident. I'm gonna take a moment to thank the subs. 
who subbed while I was getting my CD. Um, Barloaf, Frederick again, and Zarsan. Zarka? Rather. And thank you to E. Victoral for your donation. He says, Greetings from Sweden. Keep up the good work and Spanish. Uh, gracias. So, Bernas, have you ever thought of taking a free to play MMO like Sotor or TDO or Lotro and playing it with subs on stream as a sub to everyone? I don't know. Seems like a. It, it, it isn't an insult, but it kind of sounds like a lame sub to I'm trying to. I'll, I'll think of something that can be done multiplayer, which isn't lame. Because it's like, ah, starting a new character on an MMO? Yeah. Man. It's not really that great. It's tough. Ganado. Malfurion contra Jaina. Tú te lo buscaste. Debo proteger a los salvajes. Cops who ask, have you ever played Savage or Savage 2? Value. Some nice games. Is that the one where you have like the um actually let me look that up real fast. I have no idea. Well, someday. Something cool. Someday. This is the only play I can make. Shot test, do you like the Lord of the Rings movies? Yeah, sure. I like the fantasy genre. It's well produced. Sea of Death says we should play Ice Sketch. I've considered that. It's kind of fun. Petrus G asks, would you ever pick another card over swipe? It'd be tough, but I would. Sometimes. Where the name Trump SC comes from, Asbestoge. SC comes from StarCraft. Trump comes from the verb to to get the better of. Having an edge on your opponent. What the matter asks, what do you think would be the most OP combo if you could use all the cards from all classes in one deck? I don't know, but I get the feeling that if you put in, like, Miracle Rogue, uh, you threw in some of the lower cost spells also, like, maybe Moonfire or Mirror Image. Or maybe you had the Sorcerer's Apprentice in Miracle Rogue. Maybe that would work, I'm not sure. Kind of sounds horrific, though. Kind of scary. Insiders asks, uh, since the week passed, how do you like the always sub only chat? It's a lot more, it puts a lot less stress on me. So that's good. I, um, I don't have as many headaches. I, I don't actually have headaches, but my head doesn't hurt as much when I don't see, like, well met and kappa kappa, etc. That's good. I truly didn't want to um, move it to sub only, but it is in fact mainly a because I get bothered by. worthless and or slanderish comments and the majority of uh, chat like, don't get me wrong I, I understand that 95% maybe 98% of the chat is good but it's the loud 2% or the loud 1% which is really annoying and I mean it's just the effect of having a lot of viewers which I'm blessed for thank you very much for watching but it's the uh, tragedy of the comments. Yeah, it's gonna be some oh, value. I think that's not a wrong use of the phrase tragedy of the comments. For each individual chatter is out um, just doing his own innocent thing. And then they think they're being clever when they say well met. But then you toss in like another, uh, you toss in just 1% of the people and you're saying well met and you've got uh, 200 well mets on your screen and then you die.
Well, the tragedy of the comments. It's mm. not bad. Oh, and of course I get some amount of headaching when chat lethal came up and it wasn't actually lethal. It always sucks too. I have to trip because uh, flint strike is too scary. For me. Try to keep, um, against the mage just always trade. Uh, Redneck Banana asks, what was your backup champ if Sona was taken back when I played League of Legends? Uh, I was also fond of Jaina and Tark. Uh, not Tark as much. What was the other one other than Jaina? There's something. Lulu? I didn't really like Lulu that much, even though I understood that she was pretty good. Muere, mago. Uh, no! Change to Arena en Espanol? Okay. Por la cruzada! Alright, use this to kill that, use that to get the shield off. Uh, while I have a 1 health guide, it's good to get something else with 1 health out, so the uh, mage is a bit overloaded on what to do, and random proclus. I'm Coxie asked if you could have a deck of 30 copies of the same card in deck, what would the card be? It would be Soulfire, if we're talking about current constructed metagame. Uh, the question then devolves into can other, car can other people also put mm. that many cards in their deck, and if they can, it kind of becomes a really hard rock, paper, scissors metagame. And thank you to Wisp for your uh, value donation. It says, great stream tonight. Let's make it all the way to 5,000. Now I hope. Hmm. We've got a juicy video for you if we make it to 5,000. Although I am probably overhyping it. To be fair. Unete <laughs> Missiles are Kanas. Hmm. All right, we're in the top decking war. This should be good for me since I. Have a good amount of leaking. That's a very good top one. Dos daño is exactly what I need. Buena jugada. Gracias. What's a disculpa? Oops, is sorry. Amenaza? I think this is threatened. La naturaleza se alzará contra ti. Shadow Kill asks, what in your opinion is the best deck to play in construction at the moment? Um, I don't think there is a best deck. There's like a top five or six, all of which are equally good. Malfurion! Contra! Uh, Prometheus asks, in your opinion, what's the reason Hearthstone is so addictive, even considering the fact that it has quite simplistic design? It's fast, uh, there's always something to do. The cards are really good, the animation's good. And the minigame is interesting enough, so that there's no one best deck. It basically does a lot of small things right. And then the big overall picture is good. It's hard to explain. Yay. Bebe conmigo, amigo. You call me ass, I'm playing free to play paladin. What cards do you suggest I add for good control? Uh, look at my paladin arena list, and that would probably be a good place to start for a free to play deck. You just want to build a good arena deck, I think. E 
Thane says, I recently started streaming and I'm kind of successful in a short time. I feel like I owe you for that. Thank you. No, oh, I mean, congratulations. And welcome to Valley Town, Grensor. Or let me see if I can remember this. Bienvenidos. Al. Ciudad. Valor. Un poquito espanol at a time. Caballero or Senjin? This is actually a question of which card is just better, not necessarily which one's more value. I think the Caballero is better in this case. Can skip the Senjin for now. I'm notorious for not using the coin, I should just use it more. Uh, I think I should use it better. Keto asks, how often do you play games off stream? Actually, um, almost never as it turns out. So I really enjoy doing what I do since I love playing games and pretty much all my game playing is done on stream. He's doing pretty well with his totem, Lingua de Fuego. Totem. Once the shaman's got you on lockdown, the totem just carries him. It's pretty interesting. Dome is asking about the ring tournament. It's gonna be tomorrow. We're starting at 9 a.m. Pacific? Yeah, 9 a.m. Pacific. Automata asks, do you think Arena has become tougher since beta? Oh uh, yeah, of course it has. Everyone in general will get better. My answer to the Hajime no Ippo question is that I usually don't like uh, violent anime, but that one is good. Shorter, condensed version of the answer since they answered it already. One of the rare situations where Booty Bay Bodyguard is slightly better. Can't afford to hold back, and the extra plus one health is not going to do anything here. 5-4 is as good as a 6-5 on this board, most of the time. You just played a series of very, very high quality cards. Pretty tough. Darn taunt to him. Eleven. The Senor de la Arena. I'll kill the five five. The six five will still be a problem. If I go three six ten, I'll get hit by ten or eleven. Get down to two. Uh, how do I deal with this problem? Actually. I have to do it this way because it's my only way of going forward in the game, as uh, horrific as it looks. This is one of those moves where the uninformed will say, oh man Trump, you just lost the game, you didn't play your taunt, but I need to get the guys out on the board in order to have a chance for the turn after. You play the Senor de la Arena, then the uh, tiger kills it and you take six, and you have nothing on the board and you just get hit for six again. I'm okay with dying like that. Malfurion contra Tral. 
martillo maldito. Debo proteger a lo salvaje. Golem de la cosecha. I'm okay with keeping this curve because it'll go two golem, three druid. Or I could go two druid, um, three golem. Or I could go. It could go a lot of different ways. Two druid. I feel like two golem is best though. La moneda. I realize that, so I recall you saying you're pretty shy. Did you ever have problems going to places with large crowds? How did you deal with that? I don't have problems being in large crowds. It's just uh, I tend not to really speak up in the conversations. It's not like I'm scared. I just... Uh, Not sure how to put it. Also, maybe I could have considered that in taunt mode. They're both probably fine options. Could have considered it though, that's for certain. Nice. Good top deck. Crocolis. Good card to have in my hand. Aha. Eat poder de los savajai. I call down the leader de la manada. Baby Bolov asks, uh, would you hug your fans if they happen to meet you? Absolutely. And there's actually um, there's a good chance of that happening soon. If you happen to be in the Bay Area, South Bay. Since along with my uh, song that I'm going to sing after this arena, I'm going to talk about our Frozen meetup. And yes, uh, I have still not seen the video somehow, the movie, or 710. Is that seven? Right. I can clear the goal, or I can clear the fire elemental, but he's close enough to dead. They are still showing that movie Frozen in some movies. Although the reason why I started late today is because I actually couldn't find one kind of kind of a risk. Actually, I should call them. In fact, make sure they're showing. And Piazza's too. <clears throat> On turn three, I'll be playing the Golem instead of the uh, Crusader in most eh, in most cases, but not all cases. I'll keep the option open. Un gusto. ¿Qué tal? This is a slow start, but it could have dealt with a fast start by him, which is if he coined out at two. And he chose not to coin out the fairy dragon. I could actually play either one. I'm gonna play the Cruzada since he has no one one out. Uh, Guardian de la Arboleda is a excellent answer. Value. Possibly one of the best answers against the fairy dragon. No, durante mi guardia. <laughs> Not bad. I have to use the hero ability on the 1-1. One, one. 
I don't have to, but it seems recommended to do so. Which means I play a two with it, which is most likely Caldera. Hmm. I look at this uh, play over and over again, and keeps coming back to this one. He's played it in such a way that I can't make use of my um, likely better play. And I will choose not to break his divine shield. Interesting. He's chosen not to uh, break my divine shield. Kind of a way to make him pay for that. Barely. With a bear! Ah! Or I could just use the hero ability and then send the 3 1 in. Play Golem. That's pretty good too. It's a close call. Yeah, I should use the hero ability on the uh, divine shield whenever possible. Most often. Uh, my thanks to Suck and 420 and Spanish Inquisition for your donations. It was not expected. Haha. <laughs> and welcome Angry Gamer Bear and King Kumu to Value Town. Uh, Ogre. Just play the biggest card. It's the hardest to get out of my hand. Ooh, this is good. I think I just won the game with that turn. Or rather, I just gained a big advantage, and he'll need to regain a pretty big advantage to get back in this. Which is possible with something like quality. But let's see. Ooh. Senor de la Arena actually is not much better as a 7 6, but it's mana efficient. Las puertas están abiertas. Heroes are very strong. 7, 10, 15. Yeah, I'll hit him. I'm a little concerned that the 2 plus 4 can get through the 7, 6, but I don't have to take a lot of damage to do that. Done. Crap. Donde debo golpear? Charge. I could pan it back. It's a bit more secure, I think. Yeah, I'll do that. It won't be a surprise anymore, but it's okay. Getting it out of um, danger's way can be useful. I put him at lethal, or at threatening lethal, plus having a 3 2. This paladin actually has positioned himself in a way to possibly win, though. Ah. Whew, value. Way bien. Got a Benediction de Sabaduria and a Maestra del Disfranz. Cool. 